Hey y'all, this is your girl Martha from BU Crafty. I have a quick little um, ornament we're going to do with popsicle sticks. I have this little garland y'all that I purchased a couple of years ago from Hobby Lobby. And you can also find it at Dollar Tree. And I've been, I cut from this and use it every year y'all, every year. So buy these, buy these, buy these, especially if you do craft fairs and stuff. Okay, we have little music paper. And then we have a little star. Let's see what I do with it. Bless my heart. Bless my heart. We have like the my little Christmas stars that I always pick up at Hobby Lobby. Y'all grab these. Look over there at those little bit ornaments because you can use them. So yes, yes, and yes. And then we got our popsicle sticks from the Dollar Tree. All right, y'all. So let's get busy. We're going to have no painting. No painting at all. Okay, so I'm going to do these little popsicle sticks. We're going to kind of get them together. And if you're using lighter, lighter paper, I know, I know if that makes any sense, then um, you are going to want to, um, you are going to want to paint these, okay? Or if you're going to do a napkin instead of what I'm doing, you're going to want to paint them. Just a little FYI. But if you're not going to do that, then you are good, okay? Now, I'm trying to make sure y'all can actually see the craft because when we sent down y'all, it was too far away. So that's the reason why I'm standing up, okay? That's the only reason why I'm standing That's the only reason why I'm standing up, y'all. That is it. So let me kind of cut this a little bit more and then I'm going to judge it by the other one. I'm going to judge it by the other one. Okay, and then let me kind of see because this is going to be the back. This is going to be the back, so I'm just trying to make sure. Now, you can even do this a different way and use um, use the front and put a little picture in there, y'all. Use your popsicle sticks. This is a really cute idea, an affordable ornament that you can make or use as a tag as well. You cannot go wrong with it, y'all. You cannot go wrong with it. Cut a little bit off. You should know I'm not going to get it right when I'm live. I'll get it right any other time, but when I'm doing a video or live, y'all best believe I ain't going get it, to get it right the first go around. That's all good. We're going to do this because these are actually sharper. It's actually kind of hurting my hand, y'all. Okay, so now I'm going to glue these on down real fast. Get them down the best way I know how. Or get them even the best way I know how. Uh, of course, when I touch them, they're going to move. Because I know I'm in a hurry trying to make this video under a certain amount of time. Alright, y'all. So, we are going to glue it on down. And get everything in place and holding it on down. Okay. And then let me get up here at the top. And you might need to squeeze a little bit, too, as you're putting it down. And that's fine, too, y'all. Because these are popsicle sticks. They're not perfect. But they are great to craft with, and they can make anything look really, really, really good. All right, so let's do this. All right, so we're going to turn this over. And you're not even going to worry about the unevenness, because what you are going to do is we're going to turn this over. And we're going to use the edge, y'all. Use the edge. Edges are your friend. And we are just going to trace this. Okay, and this is not going to be perfection because these are popsicle sticks. If you want to cut the round, you can. But I honestly don't see the point in all that, y'all. There's no point in it. So let's just cut this out. And this is music paper from one of all my little um, Christmas collections. And I, I will put that in the description so that y'all will know for those y'all that are, you know, wanting to know. Y'all probably recognize the paper, you know, for those y'all that use, a, use it a whole lot. Oh, right, y'all. So, we're going to turn this over, and we are just going to put this on here like so. We got Mod Podge, okay? We're going to do some Mod Podge. I'm going to open this up. We're going to do some Mod Podge, and I'm going to show you. We're going to slap this on here, Okay. Don't overthink things. Do not overthink things, okay? You can also use Elmer's glue as well if you're not comfortable with Mod Podge. Y'all, Elmer's glue does work. Look at your children's 
artwork that you've kept for years and little things. Okay, hint, hint, it works because it keeps things preserved and stuff too. All right, so we got that going. Let me move that over here. Make sure I got my paper going the way I want it to because we are trying to cover up the sticks. We don't want it to know they're behind there. Okay, and we're just going to rub it on down like this as I lift it on up. As I lift it on up, y'all. Okay. Everything's down. Everything's good. And I will put, like, either brown paper on back of this or I'll do another sheet. But most of the time I just will do brown paper on the back of this, y'all, especially if I'm selling it, okay? Just to kind of make it look complete. All right, this is what we got now. I told you I cut from this right this right here. I cut a little piece off. And I'm using some of my little scrap ribbon. This is why you don't throw the ribbon away, folks. Because, well, there's going to come a time where you're going to need that little ribbon. And you're going to need it. So, make sure. Let me make sure that part's down, y'all. I feel like. I feel, I kind of feel like it's not staying. There we go. And then you're going to have that sometimes. All right, we're just going to take it. I cut off as big as you want your wreath. It's fine. And we're going to put it on here. But before we put it on here, we're going to put this wrapped in here. Okay? And then I'm just going to kind of put it down here. And i got to cut my knee on, the, on my little stool a little bit. Okay. And we're going to hang it, okay? Now, this is not going to be perfection but it's gonna be pretty I can tell you that okay we're gonna do this first I'm gonna put the little ribbon there just kind of give it placement okay that's all and then I'm gonna do another little latch right here now remember don't go crazy on this glue because you don't want crazy with the glue you want everything to look you know look good okay and then I'm gonna put a little dot down here Okay, and that is how you're going to hold it together, okay? You're going to make everything look good. And I just kind of just put little dots and I make sure. And you can even do it, you know, a little bit higher if you want to. However you need to do it is fine. Put some little glue on this. We're going to put it down right there and hold it, okay? make sure we got it good there we go and I'm going the other side and do the same as well and there's no rhyme or reason you don't even have to do this you can actually have it hanging loose if you want to I just don't want it hanging loose so we're gonna do this okay and then the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add this bow and I'm just gonna put it right here and it's gonna give it the whole effect that we want I'm going to put it right here, and it's going to be so pretty. There we go. And then, let me kind of do this. That will stay how I need it there. There you go, y'all. This is adorable. If you want to, you can add little things to it. I don't think I have anything really near me to... Well, yes, I do. Hold on a minute, y'all. Hold on a minute. I do, I do, I do. I fibbed. All right, we have this little joy right here we can use. Um, We have... Yeah, we're going to do a little joy. We'll do a little joy. And this is a pre-recorded video. I did not even say that in the beginning. But this is a pre-recorded video. Okay, and so we are just going to do this right here. And, um, you can kind of see if we'll, see if it'll work or not. Okay. Let's see if we can kind of get it how we want it a little bit, maybe, maybe, inside there. I think we can. So, I'm going I'm to slash it in half. And I am not going to use that little heart. I'm going to try not to use the little heart. Because I definitely don't want to do that. But we are going to peel this off. And this came from the Dollar Tree, y'all. Okay. And I'm just going to kind of lay it down right here. 
and I am going to use the back of my brush I used that I used um, my podge with okay and I'm gonna pry this thing stick because this is like the metallic stuff so I'm not sure sometimes I'm not sure sometimes but anyways Boom! Okay, it looks good, y'all. It looks good. Let me kind of dust some of it off. And then we are going to use the O. And let me kind of show y'all. Look at that. It looks good, y'all. It looks good. It looks good. I'm going to press it on down. And move some of that paper. There we go. Okay. And then we're going to put the O on there. And my goal is to not get the heart in there but I don't know we'll see what happens and we're gonna get it really close to that because we gotta do the Y down here at the bottom okay and I just rubbed on that uh heart oops okay and we're gonna do this right here and we are just gonna rub over it and let it kind of there we go, and then let me kind of pull it on up here, okay, maybe pull on up for y'all, who knows, maybe we'll decide to come up, okay, all right, we did get the, the, um, the heart in the middle, but that's okay, though, that's okay, it's not like a make it or break it, okay, and then we're going to do the Y, we're going to do the Y kind of off-centered a little bit, huh? Okay, make sure I got it good. Um, okay, and then we're going to do this. And then y'all are going to see how cute this is. And then we'll put some twine on the back of this. And y'all, this is going to be gorgeous. And I hope y'all try to make some pretty little ornaments like this. And I know y'all got some of these rubble transfers at the Dollar Tree. I mean, I know y'all do. Now, these gold ones, they do make a mess. I do admit they do make a mess. They do, they do. But it is worth it. And then let me kind of move it on out. Yeah. There we go. And there we go. And it looks so good. And it looks like antique. So let me grab. Let me. Well, actually, no. You know what? I have a little bit of rope over here. We're going to take this little bit of rope because it'll just look more elegant. And we're going to put it on there like this right here, y'all. Because that's what your girl does. We use scraps. I put, I have scraps near me because I threw a whole bunch of scraps over here, y'all. That's the only reason why I have scraps near me. Alright, and then let's do this. Okay, y'all. And then, you can't tell me this ain't cute okay make sure we're set and then let me cut this little fuzz off right here there we go there we go and i swear this is adorable okay y'all look this is what we got i hope you enjoyed this this is martha with be you crafty this is a pre-recorded video so i'm gonna need y'all to sprinkle this out for me pretty pretty please it's a free way to help a girl out and um thank y'all for watching thank you thank you thank you i love y'all bye